In this video, you are going to learn how to set up your Arbiter Pay account. When you log in to Arbiter Sports, you'll be taken to a list of your organizations. Click on the school or organization you would like to set up your Arbiter Pay account on. You will be taken to the Arbiter Game account set up for you by our team. Click over to your Payroll tab, where you will be taken to your Payments page. This is where the payments you need to make will be shown. However, there will be no data on this page until your schedules have been entered. To get started setting up your Arbiter Pay account, click Set Up Payments on the top right part of your screen. Select Set Up Pay Account and click on Continue to begin the setup process. First, you are going to fill out the information for your school or organization, including name, TIN, and address. Once you're done with that, click Continue. When you click Continue, the information you've entered here will be checked for accuracy. If everything looks good, you will then be able to continue with your personal information. If not, you will see an error message appear and you will have to fix the mistake before moving on to this next step. These fields here are asking for your own personal name and address. Please note that your personal information will not be saved and it is for verification purposes only. So, be sure you plug in that information and not your organization's information in order to be correctly checked for accuracy and avoid an error message. Once you've filled this out, click Continue. You will be given instructions for the next step in the verification process, which is a quick four-question quiz based on your own information. So, this information must match public records to allow us to verify your identity. Go ahead and click Continue to begin. You must answer all four questions correctly. Once you're done answering all the questions, click Continue. The final step is to establish a four-digit PIN, which will be used whenever you transfer funds, make payments, and edit your settings. Therefore, choose a PIN that you will remember. You can click the Show button here to double-check you've typed the numbers you wanted. Then, confirm your PIN by typing it again. You will then need to select if you would like Arbiter Sports to provide 1099s to your officials and workers for you. Click this box for your options. We recommend selecting yes. However, if you would like to handle your 1099s on your own, you can certainly select no. When you click continue, you will be agreeing to the terms and conditions here. And it will create your Arbiter Pay account. You have now learned how to set up your Arbiter Pay account. If you would like to learn how to fund your Arbiter Pay account, you can check out our video here, which will also be linked in the description below.